you guys thought we forgot. Do you know what's better than that? Hey guys! One of our most favorite videos. This is something we've been doing since the beginning of time. Okay, not the beginning of time, but for a really long time because we love unboxings. Can't get enough. So today, we're going to open our birch boxes. You guys know what birch boxes, right? $10 a month samples. You can earn points for friend people and you can redeem those and get really cool stuff. I have found so many amazing products, almost life-changing from their website. And we're gonna tell you about what's in the January boxes. Are you guys unboxing with us? It's like a book club, but an unboxing club. <gasps> That's what it is. We have a club and you guys are in it with us. So you guys have to wait to unbox with us every single month. Yeah, just unbox with us. <sighs> that sound is the sound of success. Did and you hear it? <laughs> it just dinged at me. <laughs> Food's done. If you guys enjoy unboxing videos, be sure to give this video a big fat thumbs up. And we know that you guys don't have lazy thumbs. No. So you're lazy. I mean, you're not lazy thumbs. Could probably get this video to 20 to 30,000 thumbs up. You know, I'm just going to give you a range. Okay. <gasps> Ooh. Let's do this. It's so pretty. And you know what I'm gonna do? I'm, so I'm gonna pretty. save it and I'm gonna like do this number and store stuff. In it, it is dang cute. It's, it's gonna really go cute. on my vanity. Okay, so this is gonna be my box versus Stephanie's box. Ooh, who's gonna win? <gasps> We're open. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my oh gosh. gosh. So I see something really exciting. It is from like a little sample version of the Coastal Sense Revealed palette sampler. And I actually have, I think, this palette it, which is really awesome. Okay, so it's like a four quad little thing and it's actually kind of nice because it's all neutral colors. Sometimes I've gotten some Coastal Scents ones where it's like bright colors that I wouldn't necessarily wear, but these are That's all good really one. pretty. Hold on, let me swatch that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So pretty. And I'm about to travel, so that would be perfect to throw in my stuff. First thing that jumps out at me is a shower gel and it's Essential Elements Shower Gel. I don't know what your scent is, let's find out. That would be another good thing to throw in since we're traveling. <laughs> The she bubble popped on my nose. No, you popped it with your nose. Oh. <laughs> it's herbally with a slight mintiness. Ooh, invigorating. But it doesn't offend me. Hey, hey, don't, don't offend, offend me. me. Sometimes I'm sensitive to herbal and lavender. Like, they're not my jam. Yeah, I it like just it. smells good. Yeah. Fresh. Oh, I just stuck my nose in it too. Fresh. Oh, I just stuck my nose in it too. Again, I'm traveling, so this is actually perfect size for that. And it's minty, so if I didn't brush my teeth, then I smell minty and they think I brushed my teeth. What is this with me not brushing my teeth lately? I do brush my teeth. Okay, this is really cool. This is the Aqua Reveal Satin Bright Soft Water Peel for face. It smooths, brightens, and exfoliates. So I'm excited about that. I don't really know if it's like an enzymatic one where it like, like the skin balls up. It was kind of freaking me out because I'm like, okay, at what point is it going to stop balling up? And, like, am I going to get down to layers? The muscle? Skin that I'm supposed to <laughs> terrified. Terrified. The first time I ever did one of these, it terrified me. But I'm not sure that's what this is. But anyway, it's cool. I love a good face peel and a good exfoliation. My next one's a face product. It's my shell derma dermaceuticals. I don't think I've ever heard that word. Advanced argan oil for the face. Oh, you love a good oil. I love a good oil. Does it smell good? Probably not because it's for your face. No, it does not smell good, but that's okay. I'd rather it not have a smell than be a terrible smell. Oh, so it, is, it doesn't have a smell. No. Okay, you said it doesn't smell good. It just no, it smell. doesn't smell like anything. It's a nice oil that I can put on my face. Oh my oh, goodness. I'm popular. <laughs> Blow it up. <laughs> oh my gosh. I'm so popular. Next, I have a Wish Body Butter. This says it's got shea butter, raspberry butter, aloe. I don't know, it's lavender. Let's see how I feel about it. You guys know I'm not a big lavender. Oh, you know what? It's a good lavender. Yeah. Sometimes lavender can be more sweet and not as, that smells crazy. really good. Oh my goodness. I don't even, I think it's got some kind of powder mixed in. Yeah, like, the lavender. it has a very like powdery. That smells really good. I really don't oh, like lavender. Oh, this is body butter. Yeah. Because it was the Wish, I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was shower gel at first. Yeah. yeah. Or like a shaving cream. I really don't usually like lavender. Lavender, but it doesn't smell to me anything like lavender so this one's kind of scary it's bee venom anti-wrinkle and I'm just like ouch bees but then I'm like anti-wrinkle yeah so I think this is a face mask yeah anti-wrinkle face mask I love a good face mask and I like that it's like this tiny sample because I can try just like one time using the mask and like you know if I'm sensitive to it I'll know I'm sensitive to it so it's just a really cool thing to try a little tiny mask I think it's really sample. cool packaging like that though. I know and it has like honeycombs on the picture and it's like it almost makes me think of like a con Something you get at breakfast, yeah. <laughs> like butter yeah. or something. That's really funny. Don't put butter on your face. Or maybe try. I don't know. I don't know. It might be good for your face. We'll look that up. Okay, so this is Radical Recovery After Sun Lotion, and it replenishes, renews, and moisturizes. I don't usually get a lot of sun throughout the year, 
here only if we ever go to the beach, which doesn't happen a lot. I wish I had more. If I ever do get like accidental sun on my face, I do like to have something to kind of like prevent peeling or whatever, cause that's just bad and it's not cute. But do you smell like stinky rosemary and lavender? Let's find out. No, it has a slight herbal, oh. but it's not, it's not stinky. It's not offensive. I don't mind you. Next I have a Cynthia Rally lip gloss in the color sugar. It's a creamy lip stain, so looks like it stains your lips really pretty and natural. So much better than my own lip color. You know they say my lips but better. No, that's just so much better than my lip color. No scent. I either want no scent or vanilla. Okay. <laughs> At first I saw this and I was like, it's a dry shampoo. I love this because I've gotten it in another box before. It's the Chlorine brand and I thought it was dry shampoo, but it, it's a sh, it's a sh, is no, it? It's no, it's dry shampoo. Yeah. Okay. Mine never had that. Did it? No. Hmm. Did yours? We have solved the mystery. The cap fell off, but it's back on. So I love this stuff. Isn't that thought it smelled good? It just has like a clean scent, but oh my gosh, I just ran out of this stuff. A lipping. That thing has power. <laughs> now you have white hair. That's, That's so why fun. I just kind of put it on my lower bits to just kind of give it. Well, you just don't spray it that close. <laughs> yeah. That was my bad. Yeah, I think it's like, you know, 12 inches. Yeah. Not three. I love a good dry shampoo. But this is like my HD of not like the drugstore type, but. Mm -hmm. Okay, my next one is, it says Catherine Bonanza Black, and it's a not a lip liner. Why would you have a black lip liner? An eyeliner, and it looks like it has one end is the liner, which is really smooth, and then the other one has a brush on it, so you can kind of manipulate the eyeliner. I don't know, like, so you can blend it out and do stuff with it, but that's pretty cool. I do not mind eyeliners all the time. All the time. Need them, want them, love them. Especially when they're good and creamy. All right, it's come down to it. Uh, Sorry, but I like mine. Okay, but let me just see. You have good size products, but I like what I got. Yeah, you know, I kind of wish that I had gotten the Cynthia Rally lip gloss and the eyeliner pencil, and I love my dry shampoo. I love my Wish Body Butter. I'm excited to try this Bee Venom Mask. I'm excited to try this peel, and I know that the eyeshadow is good because I've used it before, and then, you know, bonus lotion. Bonus. Yeah. Let us know down below what you got in your bar birch box. <laughs> if you got a birch box this month. Yes, we want to know. And we'll have a link down below where you can go check it out for yourself. Which box do you think was better? Who do you think won? Don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss any of our videos. Yep, there's a button right down there where you can click it. It says subscribe. There's also more videos over there. Yep. You want to click those. And we're going to talk to you guys in another video so very soon. We sure will. Bye, guys. Bye.